Hey, welcome to another episode of Jerome's Gems. In this uh, episode, it's not going to be a really long episode because it's only really a couple things. So you might like it even more if you're watching it. Um, in this episode, I'm going to be showing you some of my wrestling member or wrestling memorabilia. You know, I one video showed off like all my. Uh, WWF, WWE, uh, V S V H S uh, V H S tapes. Sorry about that. And anyways, you know, and off to my right, I still have DVDs, which you know, I, I'm not. I don't know if I'm ever gonna do those. Maybe some of them, but uh. I know I don't have like a, a collection like some people do. You know, they have like tons of DVDs, and but you know I have rare ones, so that's cool with me. But this is stuff I actually got from wrestling events I've been to, and what well, that's like the only wrestling memorabilia I have. So uh, what I found I is luckily be there. So first one I'm going to show you is from Unforgiven 2003. I was three rows back from ringside and that was the event where Goldberg, Goldberg won the uh, title from Triple H that's where what Shane McMahon like did a pillar to post on Kane I actually have a picture on that where he, you know you can see Shane like it's just pretty much laying in mid you know it's mid air shot I'm, I'm, I don't know how the hell I got that shot good luck and uh yeah so and then Shane fell off or fell off jumped off the uh Titan Tron so I got a picture of him doing that so uh so here's the first thing I have so since you're you know you sit so if you sit so far back from the ring you can uh you get to keep the chair so that's what this is oh I'll just put this upside down so you can see it Unforgiven. 2003 chair and try to open this up. So uh, there you go. Here's the top. So yeah, that's pretty cool. You know, when you pay a couple hundred bucks for a ticket, it helps to keep something. Well, you know, normally when I go to like when I have like my own yard sales and stuff like that. I'm uh, bringing this along, you know, sit on it because, you know, why not? You know, people that are wrestling fans, you know, like to talk about that stuff. And this one is pretty cool. It's uh, from WrestleMania 28 down in uh, Miami. I was like right by the, right by the ramp. And I think a couple rows back, or a couple of seats from the ramp. And there's a couple times, even for the Unforgiven, I was like, you can see me on TV. Because uh, I think, it, what was it? On DoDQ.com, it was like SM Radio. They do something. So I had like an SM Radio uh, sign I was holding up. But, so, all right, here, here's from WrestleMania 28. I'll show you two the upside down. So you the chair. Yep. And then what I I had to get this ship back for new PS, but uh, I actually still have. I never took it off. Uh, this thing right here, where it tells you. Um, and you have to like go out. On the one thing, I'll show you two. Uh, how long? So for a couple of seconds. How do you have to go out on this, the one aisle and stuff like that to? Uh, so you you know you have to you have to have your ticket stub. You have to have you know whatever. So I actually kept that. I never took it off of the chair. It's still on there. So. I, know, I think it's pretty cool. Well, you know, I never, that's the one chair I never really take 
out on them. Plus, here's the rock and Cena. You can uh, hate the fuck. I hate both of them. Anyways, well, I, I like the event. So, with that, uh, on our way to get our shares uh, out of the stadium, we went right by the first row or something like that. And I looked down, and there was like these uh, things that. Like just one was signed by The Rock. I'm like, well, or John Cena. I'm like, well, that's weird. I'm like, why wouldn't anyone take these? So, actually, I had got this framed, but I got this, and me and my friend got one. It's uh, the, the Rock, or John Cena's signature, and then right here is my ticket. So I don't know why the Rock, why the Rock didn't get you know autograph his, but you know I think it's pretty cool. As you can see, there's my TV uh, in the in the background. So yeah, that's, I thought that was pretty cool. And as you can see, there's the Beatles and stuff like that. If you're really watching this video, and you see where how the stuff's signed. So anyway, so yeah, I just thought that was pretty cool. Um, here's the ticket again. Here's John Cena, and I don't, yeah, like I said, I don't know why The Rock didn't sign his half, but hey, man, I don't know. I I just happened to look down at the right time, and there's a couple of them, and me and my friend got one, and you know, the ushers they didn't say anything, so hey, okay. sorry it might be. So I'll take, even though I hate John Cena and The Rock, you know, I'll take a free autograph. Why not? Alright, so that's this episode of Drums Gems. Uh, have any questions or just want to leave a comment on the video? Go right ahead. Alright.